Hi guys, we are back at the weekend. It's another Saturday morning, which means it's the result show of Cube Master. And we're going to dive straight in it. We've got some lovely entrances for this week's holiday experience challenge. Oh, I just suggest get your shades, kick your shoes off, grab a cocktail, and enjoy these holiday experiences. But it's time to jet off and see this week's entrances. Here we go. Right, Derek, for this week's Cube Master, we've got to recreate the best memory of your holiday. What's the best memory of your holidays? Best memory of my holiday is singing in a car. That's a good one, Derek. <laughs>
or two Fun and laughter on a summer holiday No more worries for me or you For a week or two We're going where the sun shines brightly We're going where the sea is blue We've seen it in the oh. movies Now let's see if it's true Everybody has a summer holiday Doing things they always wanted to So we're going on a summer holiday To make our dreams come true For me and you A few moments later Okay, Kirsty, let's get out of this dreary place. Let's get this holiday started. Okay, Kirsty, we're here. Let's get the bags and let's get this holiday started.
Tu sei ora dei champagne. Grazie. Good morning guys and welcome to this Saturday's results part of Cube Master. This week's challenge was a very good challenge. It was to reenact a favourite holiday of yours that you had growing up. Um, it's quite nice to do this this year because the chances of anyone getting a holiday this year are incredibly low. So without further ado, or further ado, or further ado, Adu, I've just been advised by the Cube Master Assistant, is further Adu. Let's go to the points. So, in fifth place this week, earning themselves two points for a rainy holiday in a tent, we have the wonderful Alicia. Well done, Alicia. Two points to you. Fourth place this week, singing every single song known to man in their car. We have Derek and his family. So congrats, Derek. Four points for you, mate. Uh, third place this week with a summer holiday sitting in a giant inflatable donut. We have the wonderful Katie Souls. Well done, Katie. Six points for you this week in third place. Well done. Second place this week goes to uh, Kirsty Griffiths for the... Fantastic use of a treadmill to make it look like a airport conveyor belt. And in first place this week, and I'm going to do something that I don't think I've done before, just because the video was amazing and the effort involved from everyone was absolutely spot on. Uh, first place is Tiff this week, and the video was so good, I'm going to give Tiff 12 points. <laughs> 12 points to Tiff. So congrats to you. And also, just for taking part and putting the effort in, Ashadi and Harry Brixey, you guys both get a point each. So Cube Master is going to have to add that to his list. I'm now going to pass you back over to him, and he's going to set you this week's challenge. Have a lovely weekend, guys. See ya. Sorry, guys. Forgot to mention, Henny, you also get a point for taking part. Loved your video as well in the effort, so well done you. All right, bye. So Johnny, the Cube Master, very generous with his points, making sure that everybody scored a little bit of something. And Tiff receiving 12 points. And I thought he was stripped. Well, can thank you, Johnny. Giving us a, a little bit of extra joy over the weekend. But to be honest, everybody on Team Tiff have been stepping up the ante. The videos are getting stronger and stronger. Fair play to you all. As have everybody's videos continually improved throughout this challenge. But I guess 
They can see the end of lockdown. They can see the prize, which is a free Cube Adventures holiday. If you're at the top of the leaderboard at the end of Cube Master. With a date to be confirmed, but we did say we would be running this till the end of lockdown. So that is getting close. And I'm guessing why that's why everyone's hotting up and putting a little bit more effort in. But that was last week. Let's look at this week's challenge. I want you to once again look amazing. I want you to do something, create something that looks absolutely epic in slow motion. I want you to make me the best slow motion video. It's a setting on most phones now, yeah? Every smartphone in the camera on video is a setting slow-mo. Go to that, press slow-mo, and do something that looks epic. It's as simple as that. We got some demonstration videos for you. You decide if they look epic. But first up, we return, we've missed him, it's been a while, Professor Brennan. Take it away guys. Well, I've got Zoe here to help with me. We're going to make things explode, okay, for the Taskmaster this week. Okay. Hang on a minute, there's something not quite right here. I don't think we're in the right clothing. Very true, let's get changed. Hang on, it's not quite Saturday night just yet. That's this better. Is a bit better, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, and I've even got the Coca Cola logo as well. Perfect. Okay, so guys, what we're going to do for our Taskmaster is we're going to make things explode. But just make sure that you check with your parent, carer, um, just to check that it's okay to use these materials and the place that uses the materials as well, just to ensure it's all safe. Alright? Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to make a rainbow volcano. Okay, so all I've done is put some bicarbonate of soda in the bottom of each uh, shot glass, okay, and a bit of food colouring on top, and I should be able to produce a rainbow volcano by pouring in some vinegar. All right, actually, Ooh. do you know what? I'm gonna let Zoe do it. Oh, pressure's on, Zoe. Okay, here we go. Right, start from this end. Yeah, so pour it. Okay, so what we're going to do next, Zoe, is we're going to do the, the, the classic um, Coke bottle and some Mentos. Yeah. Okay? okay, so. So we put it on a, a, a lid, guys, just to make sure that, um, that it doesn't go everywhere, basically. We don't want to yes. damage anything, yeah? Okay, so I'm going to do the Diet Coke, and Zoe is going to do the Coke Zero. Which, I have to say, is actually quite nice now they've changed the recipe. It tastes much more like fallback coke. We won't be drinking it though. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're going to use around four to five uh, bentos, okay? And then we're just going to try and pop them in as quick as we can and watch it explode, okay? Enjoy guys, all the best. <laughs>
Yes! 